So let me install this boiler. Let me get back. So you can see what's going on here. It's kind of a cramp spot. The supply and return goes into the ground. Or, yeah, let's see. Yeah, it goes around. But we installed. This is, uh, I think, a VR2218 pump, Delta T. Okay. Now this can be adjusted. See, right now I got it set up for 20, 20 degree differential. And right now, Say my supply temp is 91. My return temp is 86. So it wants to keep it within the 20 degrees. So I got the handle closed. So watch what happens. Supply temp's gonna go up. There's my pump watts, seven watts. So now look what happens. It's going to sense a rise in supply temp, and you'll see my watts go up. Let me open it all the way up here. So once you see 106, this thing's going to start ramping up. It takes a second. go. It wants to keep the 20 degree differential between supply and return. So this is a variable speed pump. So it's trying to get that return temp up by pumping more water. <coughs> There's a temp sensor there. That's on the return. There's one here on the supply. So we're, in we're within 20. This thing will start ramping down. Close the valve. Let it heat up for a second. <laughs> okay. All right. Let me open the valve up down here. Where's it at? There it is. And it says 131, so it's gonna wanna. As soon as I open this valve up, it's gonna wanna. You'll see the temp rise. It's starting to flow water.
the boiler installs, we're using this pump now because it's it just brings the system to the design with baseboard. We want a 20 degree differential between supply and return. Makes it run more efficient. Puts off more heat into the house. <coughs> it's going to dump down to nothing because I'm, yeah, I'm only 10 degrees difference. Right there. Runs about 7 to 9 watts. <coughs> Alright, that's the. Uh, Takeo VT2218 pump, Delta T. Alright guys, like and subscribe, I'll see you in the next one.